Great news, the EV Cafe has been at the Temperature Controlled Storage and Distribution Show. And we've been talking to some great people about innovation in electric vehicles in this space. And as we go around, I'm just gonna show you a couple of snapshots of the types of things that we've been seeing and talking about. So one of the people we spoke to yesterday was Pat Skelly, and he told us about how he's helping his customers through education and demonstration and training to get the electric vehicle message across. It's such an important thing to do to really help people understand the differences and the changes that they might need to make. So the cold chain sector is not a sector I've been really particularly close to, but really, why would I? But actually, the reason I would is because the cold chain sector delivers all my food and your food. And it is really important to this industry because you know, conversions around pharma, pharmaceuticals, they all need to be temperature controlled. So, you know, we're all involved. This is all our gig. And that's why it's been really interesting talking to Graham Thomas from Ocado. Really interesting to see what they've been doing for over 10 years now around that transition to electric vehicles. Even our woofers need temperature controlled food. So the TCS and D show has been a standalone show for many years. But the great news is it's partnering up and we heard from Mark Griffin of the ITT Hub. It's gonna be partnering up with the ITT Hub next year. So not only will we be able to see all of the cold chain innovation and technology in transport, see what I did there, um, but you'll be able to take in lots of vans and trucks and other innovations around our transport industry. I always feel incredibly privileged that we get to speak on the EV Cafe to some real innovators and today is not going to be any different. So after having, you know, Pat, Graham and Mark yesterday, we've got um, William from Volta Trucks, their uh, fully electric truck and the cold chain solution that they've got in that. We're going to hear from Phil Moon at DAF and the three electric trucks that they've got, but also the whole alternative fuel approach that DAF are taking to this zero emission challenge. And then finally, we're also gonna hear from NRG, a company that are facilitating electric vehicles into the, into the community of transport and cold chain, particularly through contract hire. So it is a great privilege to be able to get along to events like this and see and hear from such innovative people. So that's been the EV Cafe at the TC s and Show. I've missed my buddies, Sam, Sarah, Johnny and John, but it's been fun because I've been really able to talk to some cracking people without them interrupting all the time, which is brilliant. Anyway, if you want us to come along to your event, why not give us a, a call, reach out, maybe we can help um, celebrate some of the innovation going on around the electric transition in your world. Thanks for watching.